All right, Shalom, Slaki. Giving all praise and honor and glory to you. How about Shimei on Shabbat, Shrinka, Gadash, and Double Honor to the other apostles, the other bishops, the great millstone, well, peace and salutation to the elect. Yeah, so um, we're going to go into this. Um, I was in part one. This is going to be a little part two. You got this uh, Pop the Balloon episode. You know, the chicks basically. Uh, they're going to decide basically whether they into a dude or not. And if they're going to go out. <laughs> now, you have it. The chick popped her balloon. This, this chick right here. She's Judite, right? Probably Judah. Or Levi, one of them. She popped her balloon. Based on the ball city. Being from Chicago. But then she changed her mind. <clears throat> And such. Crazy. We gonna go from there. I, I appreciate your time. You, know, you feel me? This it's is fair chance, yeah, okay? This, so this is a beautiful experience. I appreciate your time. Cause you are very handsome. It's, yeah, she she dingy look good. So And you. I'm like Thank you. the tattoos really got me. Thank you. They, yeah, they, they, yeah, so then she she liked the tats. It yeah, varies. Man. No, all of my tattoos are on my neck. He's like, you got more, which basically means I want to see more. <laughs> and these chicks these days, they looking out for some Wiz Khalifa, you know, <laughs> type ish. Type -ish. I mean, dudes, you know, so like a lot of the dudes, whether they light skin or not, Jake, they getting tatted. Like, every dude I see, they got tats on their arm and on their body. You know, whether they um, done by a professional artist or not, which Jake shouldn't be in the custom of getting tattoos on their body. All right. <clears throat> you, you going off. That's not of our custom to be all tatted. Okay. Um, that's uh, Leviticus 19. I can tell you. <clears throat> That you shall not make any cuttings in the flesh for the deed, nor print any marks upon you. I am the Lord Yahweh. All right, and when you tatting, you getting a cutting in the flesh. All right, that's not lawful for us. Okay, the heathen can do whatever they want to do, but us no. Okay, and that should be simple. Um, yeah, the thun, which is yeah, just to put. You know, it should be very simple. Jake never used to do this stupid stuff. You know, that's like a whole ritual to get that whole thing done. But you know, this is the new image of Jake: <clears throat> is to get tatted, all tatted. You know, I'm tatted from my neck to my feet. You know. And certain chicks like that. She ain't look like she don't look like she got any tats that we can see on the visit on the on the outside, but she like a dude with tats. You know, which dude like I say, a lot of these tatted dudes they got slow self esteem. <clears throat> they use it as means to get attention. So as you gonna see, he gonna make a dumb reason of why he got this on. They very symbolic. Um, growing up, I was just shy. They look very me. tribal. I, was, uh, I, I really she I, don't even care about that. Symbolic and all that. She don't care about that. She talking about they look tribal. Airhead. Um, the reason why which we don't. <laughs> that's not of our custom to get tattoos. Okay. <coughs> Jeremiah Slocky. <clears throat> yeah, Jeremiah ten. So you, Jeremiah 10 and 10, uh, 10 and 2, it says, I start at the top. It says, Jeremiah 10 and 1, hear ye the word which Yahweh speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. All right, to and dealing with the tribe. So called Negroes, Latinos, and the Americans, you the Israelites. And you Israelite foreigners that have been scattered across the four winds, that lineage go back to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, which you tried. You know, it's the spirit that bear witness that our spirit that we're the children of Most High. You know, so it says, Thus said the Lord Yahweh, learn not the way of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the signs 
of heaven for the heathen are dismayed at him. All right, learn. All right, Lamud in the Hebrew, which means don't be taught. You know, in the way of the heathen, where you choosing how their course of life is, their character, right? <clears throat> their journey, their manner, their image. Okay? The heathen, the Gawayim, right? The rest of the nations, okay? Outside of the house of Israel. He said that he, he, he what he said, he's something about, he used to have his head down low. He, he got this so he can keep his head up. I'm like, Thank you. the tattoos really got me. Thank you. They, yeah, they, you they very, one? no, all of my tattoos are on my neck. They very symbolic. <laughs> Look, she, she like, man. <laughs> um, Growing up, I was just trying. She, 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 she's in there dreaming. She's. You already imagining it. Other girl over there, like, damn. I, they look very tribal. I was, uh, I, I really, I, um, the reason why I got tattoos on my neck is to, you feel me, hold my head a little higher. When I was young, very nervous. I used to be in sports. You feel me? So, you was in sports. What that got to do with you? Not holding your head up. I, I only have tattoos on my neck to, you feel me, be able to keep my head higher. Remember to, you feel me, I'm a good man. Stand tall. Yeah, so, so he his tattoos is because he has low self-esteem. <clears throat> All right? And he pretty much <clears throat> esteem himself with these tattoos. It's a reminder. <clears throat> okay? So Jake, Jake crazy. Okay? <clears throat> <clears throat> Alright, that's some crazy thinking um, You know, basic scriptures that tell you Not the uh, The heart is desperately wicked Who can know it? And that's a dumb reason You know, so you can hold your heat high What, so everybody can look at your tattoo And say you looking down like that that's just crazy. But going on. See you marry like Thank a good you. man. I appreciate that. You know what? And to be a good man, you gotta follow the law statute of commandments. <clears throat> He's not a good man. Okay. This is the book of Matthew chapter nineteen. I mean, I did I bring out this. This even Yahweh Shah who said this. This is Mark chapter 10 and 18. I started at 10 and 17. <clears throat> it says, And when he was gone forth, into the way, and they, this is, he is Yahweh Shai, or you call Jesus Christ. There came one running, kneeled to him, and asked him, Good master, what shall I do to that I may inherit eternal life? And Yahweh Shai said unto him, Why callest thou me good? There is none good but that, but one that is the most high, Yahweh. All right? <clears throat> and you say, how the hell he's saying that? But that's because his sins from his past life. Okay? As Yahweh Shai, he was perfect. But as his past incarnations, you know, he fell. Solomon, okay, <clears throat> are you going to uh, Adam, okay, if you can receive it, another lesson for a whole nother time, um, <clears throat> there's other scriptures as well, um, let me see, I, I think it's Psalms 4 chat there, I gotta think of that. Is it Psalms 4? Uh. 
There's people at the Cinco de Mayo stuff. <clears throat> it's a scripture I was trying to look for, but I don't have it at this time. <clears throat> but we all fell short of glory to most high and you know we basically wicked. You know, it's the Lord that our righteousness of him. You know. If we had the elect going on. I want my little one back, actually. Damn, I I so I can't do this the whole city. Yeah. But but I will be honest and say, like, I literally just came from dealing with someone that came from Chicago and sometimes the logic for me, I'm from the South, so mm -hmm. I'm from Houston, Texas. Mm -hmm. So the way that my brain works is a, uh, or my thought process is a little different. I know this from um, kind of what I like deal with, but yeah. you seem pretty cool. Like, yeah, look at these chicks. These chicks be analyzing one another, all crazy. I yeah. would definitely be interested. I, in, I, I, I don't I, know I if I'm your type, but. Problem. I, I, I love I your tattoos. I love your swag. Just, and I damn. So she went. She bust the balloon, but apparently she loved it. Tats loved it. Loved it. They just call it a drip these days. She looking at this shit like she. <laughs> One of those. And she the, for me she the most prettiest. You know she got this, this other dark skin joint, and I'm usually not a one that like Judites. You know, but. You know, this chick with the zebra, with the, the zebra clone, like the zebra look, that's, you know, <laughs> she look good, man. But anyway, yeah, she apparently like everything. Shoes. I love them shoes, so. The shoes, she like these little trainers, you know, sneakers. I'm a model myself. I see that you. And she a model all of a sudden. Okay. I never did that Are before. Are fashionable. I, 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 I thank you for that compliment. Yeah. But you put your fit together nice. I like that. I just work hard, baby. Yeah. I'm I a, like I'm that sorry. briefcase. Like, I mean, no. <laughs> like, you can't even. Look how she looking at it. She's to... like, what the fuck is he doing with that? <laughs> yeah, she drawing. Yo, this John right here, like, what? And I think she going to break on him at the end. Bring it so back. I like, I like the whole swag. Okay. I'm trying to bring it back. I like the watch you got, the necklaces on. I mean, you 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 got it for me. Thank you, baby. I'm a simple man. It's just I'm that city. Man. I don't know, yeah. but I have to get it. Yeah. All you just yeah. you. I, every every nigga from Chicago ain't the same. You feel me? Nah, I, that's I, 100. I, I ain't no gang banger. You feel me? I, I, I'm educated. You feel me? I, Look at it. Now she acting like she feeling them. I mean, like <laughs> these chicks, like wow. And worked hard all my life. My resume, incredible. You feel me? So, yeah, so you come with the confidence. I understand yeah. from Chicago. You feel me? There's okay. a couple women I probably wouldn't deal with if they was from this side of that side. So, I'm oh tripping. no, I I'm tripping on you. you. I'm tripping on you. But you are very handsome, though. I'm tripping on you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm tripping on you. <laughs> what can you? What does that mean? She popped up alone off rip. I'm not. I'm sad. You look good. You look good. Okay, we'll be back. Yes, we'll be back. Back. Yeah. back. Let's yeah. go to some of the ladies end of the pop and okay. we're gonna come back to her. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm ugly type shit. I'm an ugly okay. type shit. Pardon? A am I unattractive to you type shit? I just feel okay, I wanna know what's in there. Yeah, these shit look change the subject. Are there pol are there are there <laughs> policies? Are there policies? <laughs> Whoever wanted to find out would have been able to. Y'all don't want to stick around to find that out. So I don't know if there's It is. It definitely is. Of course, the suitcase wouldn't be empty. But whoever wanted to actually find out, they would have been able to. You feel me? Well, I and then she as like, you're yeah. speaking hmm. to Lily, um, my name's Adonna, by the way. Okay. Uh, as you're speaking nice to, to meet you, Adonna. Adonna. Cheers. So as you were speaking to other ladies, I thought. You keep your own. I wouldn't be able to get rid of you if, if we broke up or something. Like, I feel like something's, you're up to something. <laughs> Dang, she's saying the ball up to something. You on a scheme. Something, something like oh, the spirit I, of confusion. This is a blessing. I've never been through nothing like this before. You feel me? Okay. Uh, and, and in college, I was figuring in a out. relationship for like be a Levite. about three years. So you feel me? I never expected something like this. You know, I was in real love before. So you know, this is new. 
you know, I'm happy to be here. I'm ecstatic to meet all of you women. You, y'all look amazing, oh, bro. So, yeah, for them, for them, like, you feel me? This, oh, bro. Yeah, everything. You, you tough. You tough as hell. I'm a brick house, but. Yeah, everything, everything, all that, all that. Yeah, yeah, and I'm a provider, so. Brick house. You feel me? Tough. What kind of provider? No, it's tough. Yo, you, shut you up, man. Room, it's tough. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's tough. Okay. That's tough. Confused. Okay. Yeah, tough. Keisha What's always that proud. Keisha, Keisha proud. Shit, you tough. You, 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 you got real tough. tough. You got that shit on. You got that shit on. Yeah, I got that shit on. Bob, yeah, <laughs> thing. I'm fucking with you. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm a gentleman. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm fucking with you. He ain't drawn. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know. You give toxic. Ooh. Hot. That's, that's why I pop my balloon. Yeah, I don't fucking... know. I don't know. It's, yeah, it's, it's like as soon as I set my foot in it, I'm melting. Yeah. I get it done. Yeah. I get it done. I don't, I don't but know. I, I, I don't be on bullshit. I'm very communicative, <laughs> respectful. I, you feel me? Like, the only reason why I'm in Arizona right now is because my grandmother started going through some struggles through COVID. So, you feel me? Just wanted to make sure I looked after her for a little bit more. I like playing with them. So, you mm. feel me? And you 26. It's playful. Stop. Well, how yeah, old, how I'm thirty one. Yeah. 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 Okay. Couple yeah. Of ages, like yeah. Big girl. Yeah. <laughs> I respect it. Yeah. I'm a provider though, darling. Okay. You feel okay. me? No matter what the age was. Mm. But I appreciate the opportunity. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Yeah, you tough. <laughs> okay. All right. So we got three ladies. Okay, okay. That still have their balloon up. Okay. So can I see one of your toothpicks? Thank you. So I'm gonna go to this joint. I'm gonna skip because that's probably a different situation. Yeah. Oh shoot. Yeah. Nah, that's a whole okay. nother dude. Cool. Cool. All right. Thank you. Hold up. Okay, oh, but I think this one chick starts snapping. This girl, she starts snapping the um the girl. I I like how she look. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for coming. Let's give it up for them guys. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and bring out our next single man. Damn, I thought, well, I guess it ain't on here, but apparently Chick was drawn like she started getting on him about all his everything. Let me see. It might be here. I, I talk like, well, yeah, we ain't say little. Yeah, here we go. Let's also have like, Here we go. Thank you. This shit gonna analyze yeah, the shit out of him. Careful with the briefcase and the mic. Okay. All right. You you go. Why you pop yours? You ain't fucking with me? Firstly, you talk like my little brother. Oh, hold on. Let, Let me go ahead and go on back. I'm 26. Okay. And you, and you, and you talk like my little brother. I feel yeah. like I'm talking to my little Chicago as well. Oh. Isn't that crazy? Okay. Yeah, you're she very coming, she coming. She coming with just straight heat. But I don't like that you put the fake flower in your vest trying to make it look better than what it was. Yeah. I don't like that you brought a fake briefcase. There's probably nothing in there. And it's also halfway open. You should probably close it. Well, also, and now, Bulls was coming at her crazy on another thing. They were saying that the chick, like she don't got no, how her edge don't connect to her edge. Or this, uh, they call it that, uh, I forget what they call them, baby edges or something like that. But they, they was, they was busting on her, but. I call her Tails. I call her chick Tails. You know, she remind me of Tails from uh, Sonic. Even though apparently he's a male, but you know, she she with the light skin, like, she remind me. Of, she remind me of Tails. Don't like that the fact that she put your hat. What would be Why considered do you have a fake briefcase? I mean, the hair done. It's done. It's done. So why don't you show your hair? That's what I wanted to do today. Let me see. I just want to see your hair. I get it. You, you want to be a boss. Feel me? I've, I've dealt with you. Feel she me? She got spirits on her. You can see how she looks. She like conniving. She she satanic. Chicago women most of my life. You okay? You feel me? Me and your brother probably sound alike because we done been through the same struggles. You feel me? But I could respect that. I just wanted to know what you was thinking about. Yeah, that's she all crazy. That was. Just no, no, my little brother, so. no problem. You can't say little. I'm. You. We the same age, brother. Let's be respectful. You sound like him though. That's so because we're from the same place. So you don't like no, you don't like not. people from your hometown. I never said and that. And that's respectful. I can respect I just that. want a man with a higher vocabulary, okay. which you don't have. On your day to day speak. Speech or speak? 
Okay, whatever. Speaking to all the other women, trust. I know. Okay, okay. <laughs> he said the jump like, oh. <laughs> I, 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 I talk like where I was she born from. Shit out of I, got, I got a real like respect. I, I can't let you like, you feel me, throw down what I've been through. You feel me? I'm I never a, said what I, you I, lived with. So you, you, you tried though, darling. But you feel me? So I want you to know like, I'm really from struggle. I, I speak a certain type of way, but I've searched for education. I have you a know, some rich homie Quan type time. So That's you, fine. you feel me? What I what I do right now, I work with people every day. So I don't want you to just throw shade on hood niggas in general. Because I, I speak with a little slang. I got uh, a little hood to me, but I'm educated, baby. That's fine. We can move forward. Thank you. Okay. Mm. Let's mm. go to our mm. <laughs> he, he dismissed her. We can move forward. Dismissed her. Head down. And that's what's gonna happen to a lot of these shit. These chicks, they're gonna be denying trying to well. Chicks that already did deny elect men, you know, uh, men of the elect, they're going to get denied, all right? And nobody going to care about if you don't want it. You didn't want to choose. You didn't want to be on a team because it's going to be a team too, all right? It's going to be, as they tell you, Isaiah 4 and 1. Like, imagine an Isaiah 4 and 1, all right? Which, like you say, you got eight chicks. All eight of the chicks is with the one dude. That's going to be reality for the elect. And then that day, seven women shall take hold of one man. Saying, we will eat our own bread and wear our own apparel. Only let us be called by thy name to take away our reproach. You know? And it's us that y'all covering. This is also Isaiah chapter 13 and 12. It says, and I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man as than the golden wedge of Ophir. This man gonna be more more desirable than 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 the gold of of America. All right, are you thinking of gold rushes? How people's coming all the way here just to you know try to get some gold? Well, a man gonna be more precious than fine gold, the finest refined gold, man. Crazy. And they're going to come with much strength, you know, to take hold of us. All right. Why? Because Isaiah 32. And a man shall be a, as a hiding place from the wind, which is the destruction. The nuclear destruction. You know, that's going to come. Hey, you know, you would elect man. You is covering. Hey, you get beamed up. Okay. By his works and you following him. In a covert from the tempest, as rivers of water in a dry place, as a shadow of a great rock in a weary land. So, you know, the man is being made precious. It's the man, the elect man, that's um, going to be a hiding place. We're not hiding under Keisha. Okay. <laughs> so, you better get right and act right. All right, look your head down. Three ladies that still have their booty. She look, look, she bugging out, holding her teeth, gritting her teeth. You know, you could analyze this all body language if you want. Definitely, definitely. Yeah, she just, she, she like, damn, I just really, that really just happened to me. Let me see some body language, body language. Which, uh, mean when some a woman, I think it's like grit. She looked like she grits her teeth. I think she hold mad to say something or something like that. Yeah, people are most expresses anger. Clench your teeth. Are pressing your upper and lower teeth together tightly. Expresses anger. <clears throat> Other words that express anger include gnash your teeth or clench your teeth. All right. Image. Yep, she did just like that. 
with the jig like that, like a dog, kind of. <laughs> so, are we reading it up, too? If to... Cracking up angry, the spirits on her. She got cut. Okay, so. Look, look, look at her. And it's like, they like this. You know, the girls like this. They crazy. Um, oh, yeah. yeah. Look, then she like, yeah. make them poles. Look, she still got spirits on her. She still got spirits on her. So, you know, when I was going with that that one scripture, and that G, and that, G, G that good news translation, Ecclesiastes chapter 25 and 17, when a wife or a woman is in a bad mood, her expression changes until she look like looks look like an angry bear. <laughs> there you go. You know, she trying to hold it back, but she cringing over here. You know? <laughs> There you go. So she bugging out, man. Off these three ladies that we have here, I'm gonna have you pop one of their balloons just yeah, based she, off she of what you're snap. She so gotta far. keep her composure. I, I would like to she on the line. Pop her balloon because initially she wouldn't give me a chance because of where I'm from. Mm. Damn. And okay. that's she. Right. And, and look, he popped. He ended up popping her balloon based on. Hey, I remember when you didn't choose. Apparently, me based on where I'm from. That's a, that's a, that's part of me. You know, like us, like you know, we we profess to be Israelites, and you got some chicks that don't like us based on the fact of our belief, which is that's wicked. But they say you could be all you can be. You could be. I accept you as you are, and all this other stuff, but don't really believe it. So a lot of people are hypocrites out here. The Lord hates a hypocrite, all right? An actor, and, and women are degraded. They depletions. They are very great actors, all right? So, yeah, um, <clears throat> Proverbs chapter 11. Let me see, where is that one? Hypocrite. Hates. Hates. Wow, ain't nothing come up for hates. <clears throat> I tell you. I'm probably about to close out. Proverbs chat though. These are good scriptures too. Uh, this is Proverbs 8 and 13. The fear of the Lord Yahweh is to hate evil, pride, and arrogancy. In an evil way, in the four mouth do I hate. So the Lord does hate. This is also Proverbs 6 and 16. This is what I wanted. It says that the six things that the Lord Yahweh hate. Or yeah, you got Yahweh Shana. Alright. Yahweh wa should should buy in seven. Uh the wa bawath <clears throat> going to a abomination. Uh, the Pashwa soul. I think the Pashwa is soul unto him. From the the, the Pash. So it says, a proud look, a lying tongue, and hands that shed innocent blood, and a heart that devises wicked imaginations, feet that be swift and run into mischief. You know, you know these chicks be running to to some mischief. You know, what you why she want a thug? Why she want to trick daddy? You know, cause she want to run the mischief. But the Lord don't like that. You know, you want to you want a schemer, you want a scammer. You know, we talk about a false witness that speaketh lies, and, and he that or she that soweth 
discord among brethren. And you got a lot of women that uh, try to break up. You know, if you let her know <laughs> about things, she'll, she'll try to break the whole camp up if she could. You know? So, you, you know, even brothers in Jacob Trouble got to keep certain information, you know, from them. You know, but they're going to have to get to get right. I ain't find the scripture I wanted about the hypocrite thing, but um, I had to look for it. The Lord don't like hypocrites at all. Actors. That's basically false. All right. Fake. You know, I, like, I don't, you know, Shemel Mafa, they some Mafa. And I should not, I hate fake ones. People that's fake and unauthentic and disingenuous. That stuff sucks. All right. <laughs> So even like, you know, you got chicks, you know, they, they even get you, you highlight them and try to get their number to give you the number, but you can already tell they ain't not going to pick up. That's, that's, that's something I, which I don't like you anyway, you know, I don't like you that bad. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> and so now we got two ladies yeah. left. Yeah. So, do you have a question that you want to ask? Keisha, look, look, look how she holding it. Narrow it down. If for I you. can. Oh yeah, of course, go for it. What What would be an example of humility for you? Mm -hmm. Look at this cut. An example of humility for me is somebody trying to give me that open, constructive criticism, and the way that I respond back to it. That's that great. maturity That's level. She's still All over right. there. Thank you. Angry, yeah. clenched hands. Yo, she got clenched palms together. Let me look that up. Clinch body language, clinched palms. Palms. Right? While standing. They're symbolically clenching themselves hold back, withholding a negative reaction, using anxiety or frustration. The higher the person clenches her hands while standing, the more negative they are feeling. The body language of clasping hands below below the belt reflects the person feels secure and confident. All right, but she holding it above. Yep. So she 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 holding back that negative reaction. So going on. Not, and hey, we thankful that Esau <laughs> it got he analyzed you, Jake, and search out all things. So we bring this out. I have your name? My name is Connie. 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 I'm from California. Okay. I, I've been in California only once in my life, so. I've never been to Chicago, so. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. Why she popping? Okay. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> I right. think Connie is a beautiful woman. You feel me? She grown. You you know. You feel me? She know what she want. You mm -hmm. feel me? I, I take care of business. She seem like she want to be taken care of. So I would be honored. I if we seem match. like I want to be taken care of. No, not not care. exactly like you feel me. But I said I was a provider when mm -hmm. I first walked up. That's all and game. You still got your balloon. So. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like, I, that's just shit I like to do. I got a grandmother, a little sister. Like, I, you know, I like to take care of the women that's in my life. That's just something I like to do. You feel me? Do you allow your woman to pay, be able to pull their weight around the house, too, though? If you, if you, what you want to do, you your own person. You're right. Absolutely. You feel me? You, you can do whatever you want to. But, but. no, it's just because, you know, it's a certain type of role that, you know, men like to uh, keep when it comes to coming across a woman. So it's like, at the end of the day, are you Standard. allowing your woman to be able to provide when you have to provide in two, though? As far as being able to put that weight. I, I, I wouldn't mind, darling. You feel me? Like, okay, she want to do her own age, thing, you too. You feel me? Women got their own jobs, their own education, their own things going on. You feel me? I just, I just really, you feel me? I work hard. I got three different businesses. You feel me? I'm an owner of something. Like, I, I got a full time that girl job. That like, stupid over there, bro, holding her mouth back. Damn, you ain't tell me when they do that. We going in the body language again. When when it's, you got something to say, you're not gonna say it. What do they call that? You uh, hold your mouth back. Holding mouth closed. I think that's how you say it.
Basically, she got something she, she want to say, but she ain't going to say it. But I can't, I, I, I don't know how you word it. It ain't that she covering her mouth. It's just like she holding both of her um mouth pieces close. But going on. I want to be loved. That's the right head I'm talking about. A 40 year old. They got a, she's some administration and insurance and he's some type working some insurance type thing too. I don't mind a woman have her own thing going on. I ain't no hater. Okay. You think we can get to it together. You got kids? I got one son. Okay, yes, so you don't mind a woman with kids? Hell no, nah, hell no. Nah. You want more? <laughs> yes, I wouldn't mind. You feel me? My the, the mother of my child has her own family going on. You feel me? So it's not like I got any drama going on. I just financially support see my son when I'm able to see him. You feel me? So... You feel me? I don't mind. Yeah, feel me. You guys want to say something too? Hell yeah, dude. Of course. Oh, no. uh, he's just doing all this stuff and he live out on the street. <clears throat> okay. He don't got a spot because basically, AKA, you're not supposed to live under me. Because you got dudes that want to live under Keisha. But going on. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm new. So you feel me? Like, I ain't got no. I ain't got no troubles, no background, and nothing like that. I'm new here. Okay, me too. Yeah. Me too. For sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's get together, All man. Yeah. Gangsta. All right. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She tough. Yeah. 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 No, she the thing. She the thing. Okay. She was gonna get chose anyway. So I'm, 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 I'm actually blessed and grateful. She, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. Charming, you gassing mm -hmm. up crazy. You, 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 Why I, she I, bust the balloon? Right back. One second. Respectfully, you was a beautiful woman. You feel me? I like the pink hair, the singlet. You doing your, you, the pink hair, the singlet. You doing your thing, man. Yeah, he hair. funny as shit. The ball crazy, but anyway, I think that's the lesson of the spirit, though. Um, you know, I think he ended up picking the, he picked the, yeah, he picked the, uh, the chick right there, the um, the one chick. It's the chick with the uh. Whatever the, the thickness, <laughs> the uh, I don't know what this is. Yellow, the go. I guess the gold rope, whatever. The zebra, but not the zebra over there. But hell with the heels. Um, y'all all. This chick, she, she, she wanted attention with the pink. Tough. Y'all all very beautiful women, you feel me? I, I'm already knowing. These niggas ain't got nothing on y'all. You feel me? So, I, you feel me? I look, look at this. She proud. Like, this chick proud. Like, she proud. She, 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 she like, yeah, he better say something good about me. Cause I got broke on all day. Look, you guys are single. You doing your thing, matching the hell with the heels. Um, y'all all tough. Y'all all very beautiful. Which out of all the girls, I think she's like the least of all of them, but from what I could see, she probably like a quiet chick that you could easily like mold, but even though she destroyed, that's just what I'm seeing off of base. But I don't know, I'm gonna see in the, in the rest of the episodes. Beautiful women, you feel me? I, yeah, I'm already yeah, knowing. These niggas ain't got nothing on y'all, you feel me? So, I, you feel me? I think you're a beautiful woman, no disrespect to you, but this the hood queen right here, you feel me? And I'm from the ghetto for real. <laughs> You feel me? My art, I'm, I'm an artist. I'm an artist as singer. well. You feel me? I'm a singer and songwriter as, a, as well as a rapper. I go by Humblehood. So, like, you, you feel me? You, you look like, you feel me? What I'm, what I'm, what I want. Oh, um, bro. Shit. Okay. Um, bro. Um, bro. Okay. It's all good. Yeah. I mean, okay. Yeah. I see that. Because, oh. I mean, baby, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a grown woman. Oh, mm -hmm. I got two hands. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All that. Yo, look at the ball. <laughs> look at Tails. Tails crazy, but... Look, Tails got tats on her fingers. Tats on her shoulders. She don't need no tat. Tails. Now, if y'all don't know who Tails is, I'm going to bring out Sonic. You got Tails. That's what she remind me of Tails. But Tails supposed to be a guy, but you know. But that's what she remind me of Tails. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> look how she look. Yeah, yeah. 
Okay, so let me have you both come on up up here. You can stand on this side. Of the Women, place. they jealous of everybody, <laughs> of, of one another. Okay, and I heard you say you do music. Yeah, what, what? So yeah, man, so uh, that's all it, man. No, we can get into jealousy of women, but that's gonna be the lesson of the spirit. I just wanted to cover, just have some fun with it. And man, hopefully it's edifying. Shalom to the elect. Pop the balloon.